it goes back in just like we took it out. Make sure that this face here is turned up at the 12 o'clock position. It's stamped with the B keyway. It does not include the number. This is a B49 key blank. The first thing I notice once I have the plug out is that we have the code on here. 23G2. That's the code for the secondary key. I could go to notice that the wafers are way to the tip of the key. They're not. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and pick the lock. I'm going to put light pressure on the sidebar and rake the wafers. And it's down just like that into the holder. Push it all the way down. So we want to make sure that the key is down far enough that unless the car was an 87, 88, or 89, you can start with two. Put on the, uh, the washer. I've measured back 7 eighths of an inch and put a mark on the bit so you know how far to drill. Uh, you want to drill as straight in there as you can. Come through and just drill off the wafers which would allow this to come in and as you can see it'll come in and just fall inside the plug. You have this plate depressed, this clip will just slide back. So we just put that on there. You'll hear it snap in. That's going to lock that steering column back. And then you simply take this a half inch wrench and you can screw this nut down and depress this. At this point you want to check and make sure that the blinkers are working properly. Here I've lined up a 1, 2, 3, 4, and a 5 for comparison. Notice the one is the lowest notch, two ridge right here is writing on the shell and this plug will not come out as long as that ridge is up on the shell like that.